Hello, 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 everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Miss Glow Glow Motivation. I'm back with another video for you guys. And today, 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 it's the day we've been waiting on a long time. We are having a seafood boil. And I have some, let me get this so you guys see. I got the thing to cut on the crab legs. I have a Powerade here. And I have some shrimp fried rice. In my seafood bowl, I have snow crabs, shrimps. I have a potato and two coins. That, I think that's it. And two coins. Yeah. That's what I have. So... Let's get, say grace, and let's get into it. Father God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, I want to thank you for blessing me to live to see another day, another blessed day, a brand new day, one that I haven't seen before. Lord, I thank you for saving me, sanctifying me, Lord. I thank you for choosing me. I thank you for picking me out. I thank you for mocking me, God, to be used for your use. I thank you for each and every member of my family. Lord, I ask that you continue to keep every one of my grandkids and my great-grandkids in the blood, under the blood of Jesus. I thank you for every member of my family. I ask that you continue to bless them as well and keep them wrapped in your loving arms. I thank you for every subscriber that have subscribed to this channel. I ask that you cover them and their families in the blood of Jesus. I thank you for this food. I ask that you let this food be a nourishment for my mind, body, soul, and spirit. I also let it be a help, Lord, to my weight loss and to my body, to every internal organ in my body. In Jesus Christ's name, I ask that you take our enemy to find me in the name of Jesus. And Father God, I just ask that you feed your folks everywhere and you bless the hands that prepared this food. Anybody that's hungry, feed them, God, in the name of Jesus. And Lord, I want to say a special prayer. I ask that you look on my daughter. I know that you got it in your hand. She's protected well. And I just ask that you, Lord, fix what needs to be fixed. If anything broken, mend it back together and keep her covered in your blood. In Jesus Christ's name, amen. Thank you, Lord. Yes, so we have a seafood bowl. I'm going to go ahead and dive right on in in this shrimp fry. This is some shrimp, shrimp fried chicken and rice. I don't like the chicken in there. I'm going to tell you right now, I do not got the chicken in it because I don't like chicken breast. Now, if it would have been another kind of chicken, yeah. Mm. But I like the little shrimps that's in there, though. I don't like big, big shrimps, and they gave me some big shrimps in my bowl. But I'm going to show you. Look at that. They beat them. And then you know what I had to actually put them back in the oven. Because to me, they wasn't done. And I had to let them get right. So I did put this back in the oven. I'm sorry, you guys, so you can't see my food better, but... I had to heat this up downstairs and come back up here, so. Mm. Oh, I hate when they don't clean the shrimps. Mm -mm. See that? That mess should be clean. Mm. See, that's what happens when they don't devein them. They just cook these things. Mm -mm. Now, nah, see, that's why I can't be going out to eat. Because <laughs> I be want my food to be cooked right and to be clean. When these shells be on these uh, shrimps, they don't be clean. They still have them veins in them. Which is that little green dookie looking stuff. Y'all excuse my friend. But it be that stuff right there. Y'all can see it. Mm-mm. They should be divine. 
That's a vein, actually. But it should have been the vein. I'm going to have to really wash my board down. Because I can't be eating that junk. That junk. That's why I stopped eating lobster. Because I bought some lobsters. And then the inside of them, when I broke that tail, it was disgusting. I don't like that. So I had to. Mm, no, it just made me. Y'all see them? Mm. Got that good sauce down in there. Mm. So, happy Sunday to everybody. How everybody doing? And my, um, my sauce must have been regular, not hot. This is very spicy. <clears throat> my food just kind of got cold. <clears throat> It's spicy. <clears throat> oh, that stuff is. Oh, that spicy is supposed to be an original. y'all eating on today. My sister brought the word at, at her church today. Powerful word talking about that love, y'all. I'm telling you. It is all about love. It's all about love. The shrimp fried rice is so good. They got some really good flavors in here. I don't know what they're seasoning with. But it's good. It's seasoned really good. Mm. And they gave me a big, gigantic thing for this, over that shrimp fried rice. Mm -mm. Let's dive into these. Man. Mm. You always have to have the seafood showing. Mm. I learned that from uh, Cuzzo. Mm -hmm. The corn, let me show y'all the corn. Now the corn, if I ever go, by the way, I got this food from a place called Dan's. Seafood, D A N S. And the corn tongue dry. Like it's dried out or something. Mm. Y'all know. I love my uh, corn. I know I'm going to have to take an indigestion pill. That stuff's so spicy, about to come up through my nose. It's spicy. It's been a long time though since I had a seafood boy. And I said, let me get on this camera. Because I started not to even come up here. I started just eating. 
You know, sometimes you ain't been had something in a long time. You be ready to eat it. Just go on it and, and do what you do. But yep, my uh, I got it. My daughter had to go back to the hospital today. She's doing okay. They just wanted to monitor her blood for one night before they they gonna put her on these blood thinners. So, yeah, other than that, she's doing good. She'll be there for just tonight. God's will. She'll be back home with her grandbaby. Mm. <clears throat> Whew. Mm -mm. That stuff is very spicy. You got sauce on there. Mm. And my lip. I'm getting so like I'm getting a fever blister. Something on it. <clears throat> I have to get my water. I ain't trying to be funny, guys, but I'm really good for it. I wonder why. Let me do this. Cloud. I hope they get a thumbnail. I can't never get a thumbnail that I be wrong. But, uh, let me try to get into this cloud. <coughs> mm. Yeah, like I was telling y'all on the other video, I'm going to be moving soon. So I will actually be leaving on the 3rd of next month, God's will. But I won't be moving into my house on the 3rd now. I'm just going there so I can be able to attend these meetings. We have to go through a briefing. So it is a uh, rent assistance. So, oh, how can I open this? That's hard. Mm. I ain't even get that claw out of there. But it is rent assistance. It's through the rent assistance program. But I think it's more like. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No, we can't do that. Baby, believe me, my teeth ain't no good. Uh, we just gotta bump this out of here then. I want this too. I want it. I ain't strong. <clears throat> I shouldn't even want it with this uh, heat. Oh. Mm -mm. This is so good. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Mm. I don't think about this when you get through. Dang. I almost got off. When you get through with this, you have to go bath and stuff all over. Cause this mess and that's it, it be popping everywhere. Ooh, see? 
Man, I get high off my bed. Man, I'm gonna have to wash my whole sheets all over again. That's crazy. Mm. Well, it's good. It don't even look like nothing in here. Trying to get in this little thing. Mm. Mm. Let's try another shrimp. I don't like the idea of these little shrimps ain't divine. I like my shrimps peeled and divine. I do. Mm. That's good. What y'all, what y'all eating on the day? I know Tia did seafood boy the other day. Y'all remember Noah? You didn't like the Tia? I never know how to do these um, shrimps. I just tear it out. Just tear it out. It's too messy to me. I believe that's why I don't really eat seafood too much. Because it's it's messy. You got to pick at it. Crack it. <laughs> I'm not a fan, a fan of that. And I used to be really fond of seafood. But now you got to do this and look at that. I don't like that. You got to get that vein out of there yourself. Mm -mm. No, I don't like that at all. It's too much cleaning. I'm finna be a throw these shrimps away. I'm like uh, Tasha, I'm Stephanie Tasha. Mm -mm. I don't like seeing no green stuff. Hey, yo. That season on here is so hot though. It's very spicy. But it's so good. But you can see the pepper flakes in here. Like red pepper. Mm-hmm. You can see the red pepper flakes. The garlic. Mm. Mm. I'm so excited about my mood. Mm. I ain't have a one of them little potatoes in there. I ain't gonna holler at it. Eating and talking, to me, don't go together. Uh, <clears throat> Cause when I eat and talk, it won't get my esophagus work and push my food down. My it already moves slow, so 
eating and talking don't go together for me. Mm. I already know I don't want no more of them shrimps. Nope, because they ain't clean to me. And I can't eat nothing when I see that little vein in it. I'm sorry. I just like, that's why I like my shrimps deveined and peeled. I don't like them with the skin on, or the head. I know once I see something that look like boo-boo, or guts, I'm not going to eat it. Now, I would go back there to get the egg, the potato, the sausage, and the crab legs. But I wouldn't want nothing else from them. I wouldn't want the corn because I feel like it's either it overcooked too much and sat out or something because it tastes dry or, mm, or it was old. The shrimps is too big for me. If they was clean, they probably wouldn't be too big. Mm. But, mm -mm -mm. back to talking to y'all about, <clears throat> you know, I said my sister probably at work today. I'm talking about my real sister. My real little baby sister, biological, about that word. Talking about how Jesus said to draw the people's in with love. To not try to win them over to him with a scare tactic. You know how some people try to scare you into changing your life. You don't have to scare God's people into changing their life because his word clearly says, through love and kindness have I dropped you. So you don't have to try to scare nobody into giving their life to Christ. God tells us to do the planting and he'll do the increase, meaning he'll do the growing. He'll do the, the getting them right. Mm -mm. All we have to do is stir them his way. Just send them his way. Tell them about good news and let it be. How long we been on? Okay, we finna end this video. I hope y'all enjoyed this little seafood boy. Man, this food is good though. But it's just certain stuff I wouldn't want no more. That's about it. Look. That look like it been cooked to death. Mm -hmm. Ain't no more now. That was it. Yeah, it don't be nothing of in these things now. It, like, it seems like ever since the coronavirus came, the crab legs lost their meat. <laughs> it seems like since the virus came, it started drying up the animals. Because everything got scarce. It must have started killing off the animals too. Because when it came, you couldn't find no chicken wings nowhere. You really couldn't hardly find no part of the chicken there but whole chickens. How can you find whole chickens and not chicken legs and chicken wings? Then at one time, you couldn't find no chicken wings nowhere. How can you, a chicken is born with legs and wings. And I never did understand that. 
So what was they doing? Taking that, that chicken wing, grinding it up, making some chicken legs or something out of it. I don't know what they were doing. But I remember when you used to find no chicken wing nowhere, but it was chicken. You remember that? Y'all been go? Okay. Yeah, I remember that. When you couldn't find no chicken wings nowhere, but you can find everything else. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm, that's so good. Mmm. Mmm. So I want to know what happened to our chicken wings. That sounded kind of weird to me, to for them to have a shortage on chicken wings. <clears throat> Remember. They had such a shortage on chicken wing one time that, uh, uh, what was it? The place that sell wings, that sell them good chicken wings with that little old corn, they started selling thighs. That's how the shortage got so bad of chicken wings. And I did not understand that for nothing. How could there be, um... Uh, a shortage on chicken wings, but it wasn't a shortage on thighs, legs, and breast, and all that. Mm. That seemed weird. Mm. Let me go and swallow this food in my mouth. But I'm done anyway, guys. I got that big knuckle thing. I clawed the whole lot of shrimps. And, and them two corns, I'm full. Like I said, the corn was kind of dried out. The shrimps is absolutely too big to me. And then they did not uh, peel them. So that means that big green vein is still in them going down their back. I don't have time to eat and pick no guts out of nothing. So, mm -mm. so I don't like them. The shrimp fried rice was good. Except for this, they put a whole lot of big chicken breasts in here, which to me, I kind of think it's not chicken breast. It looked like, it looked like something else to me, like, I don't know what that looked like. It didn't look like no chicken breast. It looked like some, I don't know. So, anyway, I'm going to get ready to end this video. I hope you guys enjoy it. Sha! Sha! I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share. Tell a friend, tell a friend, friend. Leave me a comment down below, thumbs up the video. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace. I love you. God bless. Remember, we're all under one God, one nation, one love. And remember that God loved you so much that he gave his only begotten son. And I love you too. Girl, what? Girl, you know I love me a good family. What? Hello, motivators. Coming up next, this is a short clip from my daughter. She's in the hospital, and she was so excited that they had gave her a regular salad. She said it was good, um, a sweet tea, and a cookie. And she is so excited, guys. Keep her in your prayers. She's doing all right, but she's having some.